I was not seeing myself as a teacher, but it shaped very much like my conception of what a teacher is and how to bring understanding or how to bring discussions with many different people, your students, your colleagues, your environment, your friends, your family, uh, anyone. So I joined the NS at some point because I wanted to uh, discover a little bit myself in the sense of what can I do, what can I actually uh, use the knowledge that I have in a different way, in a different perspective. And that was the main reason that I wanted to discover or try to actually uh, investigate what is it this of uh, community life, which kind of power we can have when acting together or when having a common goal and having, having a common understanding of what are we able to do and how do we want to do it and then do it instead of just, you know, yes, complaining about how is the situation in the world, how many problems there are out there and uh, yeah, I wanted to be part of something that will make me feel that I'm doing something, that I'm standing for what I believe in, that I have uh, something to, to work together with someone. Throughout these years it was basically like a big uh, example of constant work done together in that, in that perspective. I never thought of myself being a teacher, so I joined the NS Teacher Training College, but I joined because of the amazing program that it provides. And I came here, I was like, okay, this is the kind of thing that I, I, I believe that can make a difference in myself and in others. Um, and then somehow uh, every year was proven or every pre period was proven that possible. Uh, we were overcoming uh, different, uh, different problems or different angles of the same problem and actually understanding how to, to get closer to, to what we wanted to do from different perspectives and in different places because that's also something that DNS provides you like you have this more global perspective in the first year a little bit more in the European perspective in the second year and then of course in the teaching uh, field that is what we have been doing in the in the last year if I would need to reflect in all these three years and try to understand what it gave me or what what have meant I would say that it has been uh, such a roller coaster of good moments, mainly, and uh, introspective uh, uh, understanding of who am I, uh, what do I want to do, and not specifically having a unique answer, but seeing myself in different uh, positions and still finding that essence of what I want to do, what I want to bring, what I want to uh, discover still because I think yeah, we need to still be curious about uh, many things and uh, about ourselves, about others and that's what makes us move into something different so that's something that uh, has been a constant here has been boosted because of the environment in the community because of the different energy of the different teams in between of the team uh, because of the teachers uh, so it's, uh, it's very much something that it's promoted and it's something that maybe we talk about it, but it's more like how you feel it. It's not just, you know, preaching and saying, okay, we should do this and we should do that and we should stand for what we believe. But you see many people actually doing it and, and setting an example. So I think that's, that's the inspiring thing of, of this place. I think I take many things of each period and that each of the periods have been proven somehow that it has an essence, it has a why. It has uh, like a meaning why it's in, in the NS. Um, so it doesn't really have, like I, I can have like more feelings towards one or the other, or I can have more appreciation from one or others because of the, yeah, the, the emotions that I was feeling in that process, the learning that I was practicing or because of the knowledge that we were getting. But I would say that somehow the only period that was like I was not expecting that much out of it it was the European reality because I really felt that it was something that I have been doing that I have been experiencing like I was studying, I was living, I was working in the city I was actually trying to mobilize in the community but then it surprised me a lot <laughs> I would say that that was a period that um, that gave us the, the chance to understand of really the power of a little community inside of a city or a little amount of people 
that is willing to set the difference and that it has a common goal and the goal is to link with people in the city and actually share mm -hmm. uh, both like your own knowledge, the knowledge that they have, put it in common, have discussions, um, do activities together and actually also encourage those that are not in this uh, pace, that are not really in any kind of uh, organization or that they are not uh, what it's conceived to be like an activist. Uh, all these people that has been uh, our colleagues, uh, that has been uh, our, um, I don't know, like the person who was renting us an apartment, like, and actually get inside of those, uh, those lives and uh, sharing just basically who we are, what we do, why we do it and bringing a little bit like, you know, this controversial inside of their own uh, life, inside of their own uh, um, path. And uh, many times uh, we met like, you know, families uh, or parents that have to provide for the family, people that it's not very much, or they said that they would like to do something, but actually they don't feel the time. They don't feel that they are able to bring something else. And, uh, and it was very beautiful to see like there is many people who actually is willing to do it's just that they feel trapped in this system and just basically like being there and actually doing it practicing it uh, as a living example kind of thing how they also started to feel encouraged to little by little maybe join some of our events or start talking with more people about these uh, considerations that they had they, this political aspects or these uh, worries that they have for the future, for their kids, for education. So it was, uh, I really think it was like an eye opener of what is the difference of actually standing in a place and actually have that goal. It's not just to, you know, do your own thing and that's it, you know, and you combine as much as you can your wishes and your um, understanding of what, the, what is needed, but you have someone else that is going to also support you in that when there is like this feeling of I'm so tired, I don't want to do more, I, don't, I just want to rest but you have still an open house, you have an event in the house and you need to prepare and it's this boiling environment that uh, that helps you to actually keep pushing and keep standing to, to do stuff, whatever it is so but all the periods were amazing, actually. <laughs> Even the ones that I was not expecting as European reality. Or teaching practice, that, uh, as I said at the beginning, I, don't, I, I was not seeing myself as a teacher, but it shaped very much like my conception of what a teacher is and how to bring understanding or how to bring discussions with many different people, your students, your colleagues, your environment, your friends, your family, uh, anyone. So every period.